let me ask you something. Do you know of God? I am not saying you know everything of God because I don't think anyone knows everything of God. But do you know of God? Okay. Excuse me. Do you purposely sin like you may know the right thing or things to do, but you choose to do whatever you want to a certain extent. Are you like that? Okay. If you get into trouble, what do you do? Do you try to pray fast? Do you try to be obedient to God when or if trouble comes? Okay, when that trouble is over, what do you do? Do you go back to sin again? So are you in like this revolving door type of thing to where you come to God when you are in trouble, then once the trouble is over, you go right back to sin? then you get into trouble again, then you come back to God like this circular type of thing going on there. Are you that way? Maybe so. I think one of the reasons problems come to us is sin. Yes, as a Christian, I believe problems are going to come to us. But let me say this. Because I had been in the past very lukewarm for a long time, I think. Or should I say in sin? Okay. As a Christian now, or perhaps I should say as a true Christian, Yes, I receive problems, but I believe I can say that my problems are more light than how they were when I chose to do wrong often. Do you understand what I am trying to tell you? Yes, I still have problems, but because I try to do what is right and perhaps I should perhaps I should say and because of God's grace as well I believe my problems are much more manageable now that is what I think Some people may say, well, Kevin, as a Christian, you, can, you can't fornicate, you can't commit adultery, you can't steal, you can't curse, you can't get drunk, like you can't do those fun things. Man, let me say this. I think as you live for God, as in as you try to be obedient to God as you seek God more and more, I believe you are going to lose interest in those things. For me, yes, in the past, I thought those things to a certain extent, I guess, was interesting. But as I learn more of God, as I seek God more, I believe, my interest of those things, like, I believe I don't even have interest in those things anymore. Huh? I believe I don't have interest in those things anymore. So I believe as you live for God, as you try to do what is right, I believe what God will do is renew your mind. I believe he will change around some things in your mind. 
there is a person I help, and I hope that person don't mind me saying this, which I won't really give, like, personal information to identify that person. But I help that person with things of God. And what I notice, I guess I can say, as that person learns, I believe that person's mind is beginning to change more and more. Right now, look, if you have been sinning almost your whole life, I think it is going to take a while for your mind to renew. I believe the reason why you think the way that you think now, I think you need more of the word of God in you. I think as you, how can I say this? I think as you learn more about the Bible and really try to do what is right, man, I believe the way you think will change. Like me, I have no interest in doing most or all of the bad things I did in the past. I don't think I have any more interest in it. Look, 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 look. Back when I was doing really, really bad, I believe I was depressed. I was messing with this woman, that woman, doing this, doing that. I was depressed. You know, and, and to be honest with you, the, the happiness I have now, I don't believe I had that when I was doing those bad things. The happiness that I have now, I don't think I had it back when I was doing much bad things. I am trying to tell you. I believe I was so depressed. I believe I was so hateful. And if you have ever been depressed, hateful, and all that stuff there, I think you can assume or should know, I guess. I believe being that way, it's not fun. I believe being that way makes you feel terrible inside, right? I believe I was in, to a certain extent, in misery back then. Probably the reason why you are depressed now, maybe, maybe, you aren't living for God. How about live for God? Give your problems to God. Haven't you tried living for yourself already? And is that working for you? Is living by your own rules working for you? I think not. Yes, I did many bad things in my past, many bad things. But honestly, I don't think I could find happiness in it. I went to bars. I believe I went to clubs. I believe I bought, you know, really nice clothes and and doing this and getting drunk and and doing some really really silly things but i believe those things did not give me happiness huh i believe those things did not give me happiness yes i have less <laughs> i think way less than i had before but i am content I believe I am. I believe I am happy now. What price can you put on happiness? Well, Kevin, you still can't do those fun things as fornicate, commit adult. Those things aren't fun. I believe those things bring death. I'm trying to tell you. Let me stop here. God bless you.